Team Up with support from the Australian government is supporting a number of sports programs in the country aimed at transforming lives through sports. Tavoli sports reporter Martin Taromane talks with hockey's in-country manager for Hooking for Health, Joachim Ronde, about the program and its aim. Uh, this program has been run for six months now and we follow go to a lot of schools and communities even though we follow just that we follow cover uh, other schools uh, primary and secondary schools even if I go down a lot PC schools as well so we look at this program and very influential law community and law schools as well uh, with them this uh, overview of this program is it's more inclusive for helping people for come and involve through uh, law hockey for promoting to digital sport hockey and at the same time um, help them to people with disability for program level it's all about uh, live well and well and lead well na objective level so me got a lot of communities schools and for help them with people lot communities even though what are no part of school or any program or community but me first I go in an engaging motor for come the part of digital program through digital sport hockey and at the same time if I give him the health awareness nutrition and also well-being for help them to uh, living blotter and also how to go through in shallow schools help them to learning blotter in shallow schools and also for in shallow future or to become a future leaders law community and schools or whatever endeavors low life or to go through. Uh, not necessarily for schools and community, me for also involved inside a lot of, me for go out a lot, uh, even our churches group, or last week me for go out a lot of the correctional service for, yeah, government this program, go with him now, mark him now, yellow ribbon day. So me for collaborate with him a for running this program with him now, the terrorist correctional officers for, Help them out to inside law uh, rehabilitation program lotta with them well-being session and also me for try for promoting healthy living and uh, nutrition and well-being inside law living lotta even though it's still low there but then ought to have to live up to those standards too because that's just part of community number two for time out about local community or to feel that they belong to a community rather than him just neglect him out. so yeah that's the thing where Mifa also go out to the community and <laughs> try for help them out a lot this other program. Uh, what the process, Mifa usually try and contact him at schools, engage him at sport masters, even the principals, and try for let them outside that this is a program and offered by Hooking for Help in, in a way that I'm sorry, promote him now, uh, healthy living, um, with them health and nutrition and also well-being for what picking in here because me a lot of time we just neglect him or things important things where him say help him out to life lower so me follow with them digital program where him just established like few months ago me follow really happy too much for engage already with them at several schools where at the moment me follow looking to that through digital sport hockey him increasing the number of participation and this whole program mainly him for Everyone, I'm eh, not for those with them able uh, body, no, and eh, for those with disabled. Me follow encouraging for if what I got him in one house where I'm dis disabled or yeah, unable for doing any activity, please bring him on. That me follow, so I got him two other activities for what people also that also feel part of society. Me follow got him other weekend programs where usually me follow engaging with the Pekini Lord schools and also the disabled people that so come in low weekend, low here, low scenes. And also, Mifa government program currently going on with them high school leagues coming up. So, Mifa try for major everything I go in with them na school competition. Eh? So, at the moment, like at school, so engage weekly na, throughout the week, every time after school, or to go into session. So, it's more technical, tactical areas like hockey. Na. So, Mifa mainly Mifa deal with them na uh, community level. So, that's what team up is for. Yeah, and deal with them community level. So me fella only take him. People where no garam chance for coming to sport, me fell now go and introduce him things a lot, sport a lot for take him in. So that lot come and be part of this fella program as well. And at the same time, him also have a stepping stone where I'm helping for promoting to this sport hockey. 
So me fella work together with him uh, hockey federation for try and be, get him this whole sport come up strong. No? So me fella look him a good ten up lot beginning, and I think one of the thing where me fella look him that him very positive for me fella is a number blow female him more than number blow male. So it's a positive outcome for me fella where even other Oceania partners me fella are very I mean happy too with what them. So far, I'm going on this time. The partnership with them, Team Up, it's Team Up is the group that is look after the Australian government funded program. So Team Up is more like uh, Osport. So Osport is dealing with uh, elite athletes, and then Team Up is dealing with community level based athletes. So Team Up is more yeah, grassroots level now. So that's how this program comes. So this program has been. Start last year with them uh, to come over and then having a, I mean, uh, training for getting six sports low yellow Solomon and for Solomon it's so far me for having six four sports now I'm already having a uh, established a uh, partnership with them team up so this for six four sport me for hockey lucky too for going be part of this for I mean be part of this for a team up program. Yeah? Uh, so far, I think three or four fall spot now. Me fall under team up. Me fall already on the running. Yeah, me fall start for implementing the program. Me fall. I think few other, I mean one or two spots are still finding way of for when to start. Me not sure, but me looking with them this program. I think um, him no. I mean, this is a first year. Me fall not completing it yet, but uh, me looking um, influential the community. Yeah. So with them cooking for health program, we look him him very influential because because a lot of kids engage inside and also you can anywhere out no given chance, yeah? Or left out of school or or just stay around the community no more, or to come and involved inside. So I'm, I'm just giving me I mean me for the team a very big boost lot how me for implementing program on health too. And at the same time Hockey itself benefit out from it with an increase of participation law, future athletes play them too. And at the same time, it's more a building development pathway too for this fellow sport hockey. Team up partnership by him ran for one year period. So me fellow go on for one year and then by me fellow got him a about a review of this program mid next year and then after that. Then both decide for how many years for to and for other countries like me follow government partner I mean partners with the same kind of program low one or two PNG and they've been running for four years three years now so yeah so me follow look forward that this program by him continue the future because it already make changes to uh, kids around the town so yeah and now I think this whole program is all about so me look forward for uh, more maybe. Three, four years more. The next uh, contract time, if I for sign him, renew him back contract, and we look for another three or four years more for this program for him implement the Yellow Solomon. Apart from hockey, the team up program is also collaborating with other sports such as football, surfing, and just recently basketball with the support from the Australian government. Martin Taromane, Tavoli Sports.